Hello, beautiful soul. We are beginning a new week as always, inviting our angels to be with us, to bring their love, their message, so we can understand the energy. So today it's Monday and Tuesday guidance. It's February 25th and 26th. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Maria. I'm here to bring the angels closer to you on a daily basis and to help you understand that they truly are with you every single day for everything you need. So if this is your first time in my channel, remember to click in the subscribe button below, also in the bell right next to it. So you'll be joining our beautiful souls family and you will be receiving notifications when a new video comes through. So I got the cards right here. Let's begin shuffling and let's see what the angels are preparing for us, what they are asking us to do or what guidance they have. What is the energy for these two days? Let's continue shuffling until the cards and the card is here. Let's see. So we got Chantal. Oh, that's a good one. I don't know if you can see it. So Chantal, it says new romance is imminent either with a newcomer or through reignited passion in your existing relationship. Be open to giving and receiving love. My dear, beautiful soul. Most, the main message of this card is basically love. Give and receive love and how important it is to begin your week with this energy. So invite the angels to really be with you throughout the week, open your heart for them, open your heart for divine love to come through. So you will be vibrating in this energy and then you will touch others with it as well. The more you are giving and vibrating love, the more you will be receiving love as well. Love is what creates all. Love is not only about romance, it's not only about relationships. Love is everywhere, love is everything. Love created you, me, and everything. Whatever it is that you're watching now, computer, laptop, phone, whatever, everything is created by divine love. So the angels are inviting you to really be in this vibration, to invite this energy to be within you. So you will be expanding throughout the week. Like I told you, love can create everything in your life. So they are really, really bringing you this card because they want you to understand the importance of this energy in your life especially now especially now so close your eyes and always you know just invite this divine love to stream through you feel it feel it within your heart feel the warmth of this energy taking over feel your heart expanding because this is what love is about and understand as well, they are also telling me to actually tell you, because some people, this actually is going to resonate. They are telling you, they're reminding you as well, how important it is to receive love. Life is not only about giving, it's an exchange of energy. So everything you give, you have to also receive. And you need to give yourself credit for that. You need to give yourself a... Um, value enough to be loved okay my dear they're really saying that many of you are just giving it so much but then you don't get anything back you don't get anything in return and still you move on still you drag yourself in this kind of relationships in this kind of situations where there is no love there where only you are the source of love, but you're not getting anything in return. But then you need to understand that if you're not receiving anything, it means that you're not loving yourself. It means that you are telling yourself you're not worthy. And then it, there is a breakage, there is a, a blockage created in this. Yes, it's important to give without asking anything in return. But you need to give yourself enough credit. You need to give yourself, you need to honor yourself for who you are and allow yourself to receive love as well. So give yourself love this week. Invite this energy and feel this divine love streaming through you and love yourself 
more than anything else in your life. Take good care of yourself. Make sure that you feel loved by you more than anyone else. If you're not feeling loved by others, it means you are not loving yourself first. Okay, my dear, so beautiful. I hope this is resonating with you. Thank you so much, beautiful soul, for joining me once again in another guidance. Okay, I'll come back now on Wednesday with the next message, the next inspiration from our angels. Remember to join me also on my Instagram and Facebook to keep the connection, to keep in touch, okay? With more guidance, with more connection with the angels. Also, I just wanted to let you know that the angelic month for March is open and it will close soon actually it will close on monday night okay on february 25th night today at night <laughs> okay my dear so if you want to join the angelic month to receive your own guidance with meditation properly done to you specifically to what you you know the meditation is created specifically to your needs in the angelic month so it's a really beautiful and very private and very close work with the angels Anyways, if you want to get more information about Angelic Month, it will be in the link in the, in the description. Okay, have a great day. Have a lovely week in the company of your angels always. Take good care of yourself. Have fun. Enjoy and love yourself. Okay, I'll talk to you on Wednesday. Namaste.